Hey everyone, it's Tanya at Viva Scrapper, and um, I made some more tiles for the Reese's Rainbow um, charity thing that Marion Smith is doing. Um, if you haven't already made some tiles and sent them in, go to Marion, um, go to a piece of a piece of craft.blogspot.com and look for the Wednesday, April 13, 2011 post and it'll give you uh, the details um, of what she's doing and there's a video. Um, so a piece of craft.blogspot.com and look for the Wednesday, April 13, 2011 um, um, posting. But I have already did one video where I did four tiles and um, I did another four this weekend or today actually so those are the four that I'd shown before um, ooh, in my last video you couldn't really see that lady I did perfect pearls we can see her now um, she turned out really pretty so anyway those were the four I did before and these are the four that I did um, today actually I did two of them this morning and then two of them just now did these two this morning and then these two just now while watching tutors um, on my computer but let me show you them a little bit closer so I used um, from that Mother's Day album that I showed earlier um, I used all those kinds of scraps from there so that's how I got rid of my scraps so it's for a good cause so this one is uh, she is the queen of her own crafty kingdom and I just, I don't know, I just chose that, that stamp because I thought it was cool and um, created these purses using a Sizzix. This is actually, this is actually a big uh, original Sizzix and these two are Sizzlets. Um, and then I used a lot of Sizzlets, Sizzix stuff that I've had for a while that I've never used. Um, so here is another one. Um, this is kind of, I don't know. It was, a, it was a stamp, I think. It was part of, it was in the Mother's Day um, packet, but I didn't use it. But these perfume bottles, I had, it's an original Sizzix dye. And then um, I just added some flowers. This is uh, crepe paper. Yeah, okay, and then there is another one. This is a, I think it's an original Sizzix dye, but recent, or before the Big Shot came out, I think. Um, the purse also came with it, um, but the quote is, decide to make every single day the very best day of your one precious life. Um, I love that quote. I think it's really nice. And then this is the final one. Sorry, my finger got caught. Um, these dies here are Sizzlet's dies, um, and in, there's a stamp. Um, I think it's a Unity stamp. I think this one, I think this is a Tim Holtz. Uh, this is a Unity stamp. And then this one is as well. So just be you. So I thought they turned out pretty good. So I have a total of eight tiles. I'm going to continue to make more with my scraps as I work on projects to. Um, to send them in by June. Um, I think Marion's doing this all year long, but um, I think the first auction is in June. Um, so if you don't know about Reese's Rainbow Charity Tiles, um, go to, as I said, um, a piece of craft.blogspot.com. Look for the Wednesday, April 13, 2011. Um, posting, and at the bottom there is also she gives a story says where to send them um, but look at the watch the video I think the video tells you all kinds of criteria and stuff I know it just has to be like browns and like vintagey looking like um, stuff nothing hanging off the sides four by four um, nothing big hanging off the sides and um, because they're gonna combine a bunch of them and make into like maybe like four or something like that and then they're going to auction off the tiles, so the one gigantic tile. So, um, good cause, great. It's for under uh, underprivileged, handicapped children that need homes, and it's to fund um, people that want to be parents of these underprivileged children. So, great cause. 
Um, so get your tiles in. Talk to you soon. Bye. You can